there are five key items that the Hensley GET user will come in contact with. They are the Hensley XS GET adapter, the Hensley tooth itself, this pin, a socket wrench in the appropriate size socket, and a wire brush. Before any work takes place, please complete a Take 5 safety check. Make sure the bucket is secure before removing or installing the Hensley teeth. Check that the bucket is stable and that the bucket bottom is horizontal. You can make sure of this after the engine is turned off by turning the key switch to the on position and moving the control levers with full strokes. This ensures that the bucket is settled and then lock the control levers. Ensure isolation and personal danger tags are fitted to the machine. Grab the wire brush and get rid of any material around the pin hole. Make sure the pin is fully exposed. You should find the pin in a locked position which means it's inserted into the tooth and the adapter. Insert the socket wrench into the pinhole of the tooth. Turn the pin locking the shaft 90 degrees anti-clockwise to unlock the pin. Slide the pin out of the old tooth and adapter. Slide the old tooth off the adapter. Again, we use the wire brush to clean the adapter's nose and the pin hole. Get rid of as much of the dirt and other material as possible. Slide the Hensley tooth onto the adapter. You need to line up the hole on the tooth with the hole on the adapter. Once that's done, you can slide the pin into the tooth of the adapter. Insert the socket wrench onto the pin and turn the pin locking shaft 90 degrees clockwise to fasten the tooth. And after a short period of time, you're back to work.